Minnesota, back to the state of Minnesota. Ethan, you don't have a bag over your head? No, I do not. You guys took care of Rutgers. Yeah, Iowa beat the FCS of the Midwest. We we beat the FCS of the East. So, you know, it goes very well together. (laughs) I don't know. I was just glad the defense played better. Uh, I think Tanner Morgan still sucks. Uh, I don't think the offense trusts him at all. But they ran it 42 times with or something like that with Mo. And uh, even before the game, Flex said yesterday on his radio show that he told Mo he was going to get 40 carries. So I think that kind of tells you everything you need to know about them trusting Tanner Morgan at this point. Now, Ethan, at what point do you go to the the young man who played against Penn State, maybe see what you have for next will. year? I wish they would, but that's just not – it's not Fleck. He just won't do it. I don't know why, but – I mean, Tanner, Tanner wasn't bad. He was 16 to 21, like 180 yards or something like that, and I guess – That's the formula with him. Yeah. I'm and according let him to Fleck, throw the ball like 20 drops. times. Yeah. Yeah. But even then, it was nothing. It was all like nothing big. Like no explosive plays in the off and like the actual very, passing very game, which is the issue. Very safe. Yes, definition of it. Like they need to like actually start making these chunk plays. You can't do like five, ten. You need like a twenty, a thirty. Like you need to, you need those big plays to to win games. Now here's my my question: Is let's say a couple of weeks from now, you know. And, and I'll throw Iowa in this conversation, too. Both Minnesota and Iowa are eliminated from the Big Ten West cont- contention. Yeah. All right. They're not winning it. At what point do both of these coaches' staff sit back and say, these guys aren't – they're not our guy next year. We, sh- we should go to this, this – see what we have on this younger roster. So what happened this year at the quarterback play doesn't happen again. Or both of these coaches, coaching staffs loyal to a fault. I, th- I think Fleck for sure is. He won't bench Tanner unless he's hurt. Gotcha. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just curious because you think that's some sort of conversation this coaching staff would want to have to you, see. You think they would? What our future is? Because I mean, Ethan wasn't bad versus Penn State. He was fine. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Wasn't he you know, a decent recruiter? Uh, a guy that yeah, he's a out of, out of, out of four star out of Illinois. Yeah. I don't know. It just, it just, it makes you think, you know, at some point you have to look into the future, even though some guy's given you six or five years, it's, you know, it's, it's, it's time to move on. Yeah. What year, yeah. what year is, is he a true freshman or redshirt freshman or? Uh, redshirt freshman. Okay. Gotcha. If I remember 